You guys saw the title. This is like a most asked question. Everyone, Everyone wants, to wants to know about, about it, and I'm really uncomfortable to talk about my own shit, like serious shit, on the internet because I just assume that nobody wants to know about it. And my t shirt is matching the background, which makes my head like floating on the camera. That's nice, but we're not talking about clothes today, so just don't fucking roast me for my outfit. I just want to film this video immediately to avoid me watching others, other creators video of this topic so I can have an idea for me to explain my fucking situation that I fucking dropped out of college. Cool, right? I just don't want anyone to think I'm using someone's side. Oh my- Bro! I just don't want anyone to think that I'm using other creators' ideas to explain the same situation. You saw the title. I dropped out of college, which is pretty common in the US. Bruh. I mean, I'm not being sarcastic or anything. It's kind of common in the I mean, Western country, but most of you guys might know I'm Asian. Asian kind of had that mindset of I've been talking for so long and not answering the original question that you guys came to this video so I'm not gonna explain the whole Asian culture thing I'm just gonna get right into I feel like whenever I have like no video idea I'm just gonna do a sit down video and here's that sit down video for no fucking reason you're welcome. But still, just go grab yourself a snack or a drink or coffee. It's like almost 7 a.m. I mean, almost 7 p.m. I won't get another cup of coffee. I have water oh. instead. So I graduated secondary school for your reference. We don't have like middle school or high school kind of thing. We just have secondary school. Six years of secondary school, I graduate. And some of you guys might know I was in the Hong Kong team. Um, I still kind of... Okay, not really. Okay. I swim as a part-time swimmer in the Hong Kong team. I kept the contract kind of thing for a year in my first year of college. I was major in hospitality, so it's not cool. I have serious interest in it and growing up, I don't really like going to school. So the main point is growing up, I don't really like studying. Like people force me force to study because you're forced to study secondary, right? I'm not that interested in studying like academic thing. Growing up, I hate people forcing me to do things. I finished the another year of the swimming Hong Kong team contract thing and I wasn't good enough and I just give up on swimming. So one of the reasons I wanted to go to college is that I just want to keep on swimming. Back then I didn't really knew what I really wanted to do do. I think I just thought that going to college and keep on swimming my thing to do because everybody was doing that. I mean everybody is still doing that as their thing. And studying in Hong Kong, I mean I live in Hong Kong and studying in Hong Kong is not that easy. Growing up I'm not that typical kind of kid that oh um I have to get a degree. I have to be this society standards or something. So in conclusion I just dropped out for because I don't want to go to school. I didn't mean that you should drop out of college just because you don't like school. In my opinion, of course. Uh, you should just go for things that you like. If school really did mess up your mental health and you really, really hated it. Just go and pursue whatever you want. No one blames you and, and you can go back to college whenever you want. And I really am not crying. It's just really late at night right now and I really need to go sleep, so... I truly understand that everyone has that kind of stress studying in college like in everywhere around the world obviously I mean having a degree is obviously better than you don't but in my opinion I just don't think it's a very necessary thing in my life and I just don't want to pay so much money to go do something that I don't really like like studying in a college for so like studying in a college for four years and I know the fact that it would 
really really mess up my mental health Bitch, you already did This video is way too serious for me I don't really do videos like this anymore There's like a side story kind of thing I think it's also important to let you guys know that I was going to somewhere to be an instructor of scuba diving But ends up, I mean ended up, I didn't go I still wanted to obviously but um, maybe the opportunity is not right I planned that for really long not really long but I planned that for a short period amount of time but turns out it, it didn't go well in the process of me moving to another country to be a scuba diving instructor that didn't work out yeah that didn't work out so I decided to have a break from <coughs> oh my god so I decided to have a break from boys please tell me you know that reference and after that huge mess I just am um, doing YouTube and doing my part-time job. I also coach swimming. I apparently have an online store. I've been modeling. I mean, I did a modeling job, but not for like fashion brand or something. I did modeling for a brand a few days ago. It was fun, but I usually do modeling for photographers because uh, I'm a really huge, big, thick, chubby uh, i think it's not the right word um chubby kind of girl i don't really think that people like me modeling clothes so i uh, i don't know that's not the main point though another important thing is that i plan it to i mean i'm still planning uh, to get a job like full-time job overseas because i'm not a fan of living in here i mean hong kong is a beautiful city but i just am not that kind of Gal that living in a city like that. Yeah, it's still my home. I love this city, but I don't like living here. So we're in the middle of a worldwide pandemic now, so I can't really do that. Uh, I've been working on stuff like here and there. Um, to live my life. Huh? Uh, uh. Sorry, I think this video won't be long. Apparently you guys like short videos, right? I don't know. You all know, obviously, that studying in college is really stressful, but I mean in Asia, not being in college is really stressful too, because everyone looks up to you really bad. Being like graduated college and getting a degree, getting a master degree or what, and Hong Kong is like one of the smartest city in the world. I mean country, city. Uh. I know after that people will come for me because I'm dumb but just a joke oh my god just fart <laughs> it's very hard people look at you as in you're not a good example for a kid I don't know it's just a lot to deal with I mean those are stressful stuffs but I don't really care what strangers think of me I mean I do care but I don't care as much as my friends like close friends and family i have asian parents so i don't know why is it why is this getting personal right now no no this video is supposed to be me explaining the whole situation i don't fucking care uh, that's not really my thing anyway so i think it's almost time for me to have dinner i also want to explain why i mean i already explained it this in any of the video why i start speaking english in my videos i like to say it one more time i mean clearly i just don't want to like trap in this city right i just don't want to speak cantonese which is my mother language if some of you guys might know or don't i don't really care i just want to speak english right now so what i don't think i explained anything what i meant was i don't want to get attached in this society like you know what i mean right mm. just I mean just I'm not trying to be rude to people that wants me to speak in Cantonese because they are Cantonese and they wanted me to speak Cantonese but I do not want to I'm your bitch <laughs> but you don't get to tell me what to do so and um I swear the next video is gonna be like more entertaining uh, it's gonna be a flop I think yup I swear it's gonna be fun I'm gonna see you soon okay and thanks for your love and support from my previous video which is speaking with Karen and Brittany I really love my friend just subscribe if you want you don't have to but it'd be cool if you subscribe I'm still really full from my nun nunch lunch guess i'll see you guys next time or not um uh right okay bye they're really cute right i did that myself
Bye.